Well, oh, figure it out quickly. Uh, oh, shit. That's fine. Wait, uh, how, how are, wait, what were you recording in? Hold on. OBS is to... a .mp4. I still have the file. You might still have it. Yeah. I still have it, but yeah. trying to play it doesn't give a producible thingy. Mm, is it? It's corrupted then. There's a chance. There's always a chance that those don't corrupt. But oh like yeah, I can restore pages. Nice. Okay, so that's still there. So at least <clears> I don't have to reopen all that crap. Uh, let's Damn, see. we lost. We lost. <laughs> Scorpius killing the grand the grandfather. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. So no. Hey, it's there in our memories, and I did stream it. So, stream oh, might have it, might then. not. I don't know if it recorded anything, though. I don't know how to do that. No, once you stream it, it, it makes a recording on the stream, but it will be replaced by the next video. But you can hmm. download it from there. Well, you're welcome to go ahead and do that, Aiden. I think you know my channel, otherwise I'll try and do it, maybe. I don't okay. have your channel. Rip. Well, I'll post it. I didn't it. know you had a channel. Okay, Lydia, what was second. the question you were going to ask me? Has Scorpius endeared himself yet to take yeah, for me? I, I think so, yeah. Okay, oof. Okay, I remember at least what y'all thought, and I have that written down in more than one place, and I didn't copy-paste it like I should have. Let me get that, actually. Oh, yeah, I had I had that problem a little while ago. I had a bunch of notepads open that I didn't save, and then power died, and I, I was like, oh, God. I save all the time. Literally, I'm I hadn't for saved time. for, like, a good while. I was working on spells, and I was fixing my character sheet. Oof. And then just power now, like, Fuck it, I'm not doing that again. <laughs> so true story, Aiden, you correctly guessed that one time that the assat that the beggar you encountered was the assassin in disguise. But you failed your perception check to notice this in the heat of battle. Uh, okay. Wait, what beggar? You recall there was one time when I was like, hey, maybe y'all have already met the assassin, and you're like, oh I bet it's that beggar. Look of this place. I called it, the though. Bigger, you did? The beggar I said fuck off to. No, you gave him, like, three gold. No, I did No, Scorpius no. gave him three gold. I said fuck off. Yeah, yeah, I gave him three gold, and then I took his life. Uh-huh. Best exchange ever. He got the three gold 10 back. out of ten. Okay. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have to re-roll up this crap. Good news is I already remember how many. So it was two of those thingies, and I apologize. Now I have to do this again. So, seeing as I've lost my two three hundred acres, I'd have to check. I mean, you never. Yeah, I was wondering. Check. I was curious about that. What happened there? The fuck are these things? I, well, I'm good. sure there's probably something else where my land should be, but if it's still in the same general location, I'm claiming whatever the fuck is there. I mean, technically, it's still your land over there. Yes, this is true. <laughs> you have the paperwork. Maybe? I don't know if that works. Okay, bravo. Actually, how far is my land from Grills is now land? Well, you don't know where your land is. That's the first problem. Yeah, they both have that much hit points. So they get... Perfect tax. I need to reread this really quickly. Okay, party. It is uh, early, Hi. early morning. Y'all are not quite at the point of waking up yet. And uh, you will... Oh, I moved up to the wrong thingy. You will awaken to the sound of screaming. As something is attacking the town. Okay. Uh... I'm gonna go mark off one day on my armor. Grab my backpack and my crossbow. Oh, do I have time set up properly? I mean, I, yeah, it's good. Okay. I donned my gear as well. Alright, donning gear. Scorpius, Umbra, anything special? 
Putting on my armor and getting ready. Move the bed and into the hall. Move bed into hall. Okay. Well, patrons are looking around nervously, and there's town guardsmen running through the streets towards the northern wall. Okay. Headed downstairs and outside. Downstairs, outside. Scorpius, Umbra, Borgov, are you all linking up together? Hmm? Are you all linking up together? Yeah, I'm following them. Okay. Scorpius, Umbra. I'm typing. Give me a moment. You are typing. Done. Okay. Yeah, I rolled up demons. <laughs> hmm. I guess they are kind of common now, from the uh, after things that didn't go away after the bloodman. Wubble up, dub dub. Uh, are we typing things out of character, or are not actions? Or I mean, Scorpius is currently putting out actions. The command word undoes the trap, going down with his two daggers. Okay, Corvop, no about are demons you? that much. Yeah, a couple I'm less sure than like a week ago, know. there was a fucking demon invasion when the moon turned red, and you hid under your bed and, it, and prayed that stuff would go away. And when your parents had to go deal with them. No, no, most people were hiding. Borgov, you were an aspiring fighter, but you weren't suicidal. We are. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Acromede, you will see. Uh, will you see? I mean, one of us has actually died now. Okay, Acromede, Umbra, Borgov. You'll see each other. Scorpius does not appear to be found anywhere. Uh, okay. Well, I'm assuming, since I had to undo the door before Umbra yeah. got out, she would have seen me go invisible. Yeah. Umbra, you'll see Scorpius whisper to the ring, and uh, he turns invis. Uh, I will. can't even follow my footsteps. I'll just go. Right. Yes. Umbra, you're Again, going. Plan. Well, I would have to stop anyways to put away, you know, his stuff and... Or if you if you say that number, we'll just say, "Don't die." That's the game plan. The plan. It is. Now get ready. Just one question I forgot to ask. Since I have a ring of invisibility, I can just do, if I backstab, am I invis am I visible? You will break yeah. invisibility when you attack. At that point, you would have to say the command word again. I right, really noticed. Party, you all are doing this? Moving north, see what we see. Okay, moving north. Scorpius his... will approach on uh, a four meads right side and whisper he's here. Are you willing the ring off for a second so you can communicate? Shit, I forgot the game here. Yeah, no. yeah, yeah, Meade, you did fail your hidden roll for seeing okay. Scorpius. I am ruling that now. Well, I figured you were. Okay, so party, you all are moving northbound, and uh, yeah, at this point, what is happening? Well, like I said, there's a ton of screaming as a... How tall is this thing again? Twelve foot tall. Two of them. I shall post a picture. Mm, large. It's three times it's my height, that's... These things. Mm. Two of them. Big. Big bat wings, some type of mm. whipped uh, thing that's a bit hard to see, and swords. Those kind of look like lightning bolts, don't they? But those are swords. Yeah. Proportionate okay. bolts size, like that babies. appears to be long sword sized. I do have my spells back. Mm -hmm. So, I hope he's ready. They just flew right over the wall, and they're in the middle of town tearing through shit. Town guards attempting to... Uh, Resist. That reminds me. Yeah, I check this. up instinctively it gets out of his pole arm and keeps that full length if okay. between in him and them. You know, what? I may not remember if this works or not, but we're gonna find out. I'm waiting to see new. Yeah, no. So, party, you're still maybe a hundred or so yards away. I mean, technically further. You'd have seen these guys from a distance. They're not being subtle. You all approaching to attack? Or lightning bolt. Uh, Okay, They're airborne. Gormid going for the forked lightning bolt. No, at this point, they are ground-based to Gormid. Okay, in that case, I'm going to aim high. That way, my bolt goes over normal-sized people's heads. 
You said they're 12 feet tall, so I should be able to do that. Mm-hmm. Uh, Scorpius Umbra, Borgrov. Y'all doing anything as a Chromeed starts to do casting noises? Okay, moving forward to be in range of 60 yards and casting Hold Person on them both, minus one to their saving throws. Okay, Scorpius, what are you doing? And Borgov, I have you scared out of your fucking mind. Yeah, you are seeing your companions sprint at the demons. Well, Koromi is standing still to cast. Umbra is moving and forward. Some of us are running. Scorpius, you're going to be moving forward this round with Umbra. Mm-hmm. Okay. Attempting to backstab attack attack while waiting for Bossman's spell. Are you staying with Bossman or are you going with Umbra? Going with Umbra, but I'm not going to go in just... Yeah, I'm going to wait right. for the spell to go off. Umbra, you're going to charge forward to Chromeed. Fourth lightning takes, I believe, three segments to cast. Yep. So that's 18 seconds. You'll be charging still, Umbra and Scorpius. Borgov, I still don't know what you're doing, and I'm going to give you a little bit more time before I just have you scared. I mean, it's his first time playing fighter. Borgov, you are scared. Oh, very preciously ways to see the first bit of this comet goes. Scared is Whirl, of course. Hold on, that was autocorrect. Ah. Okay, uh, so, Chromid, you may dice your damage for the forked lightning. Let me check. What are we looking at, Grills? 44. 44. Demons take half damage from lightning by default, becomes 22. They get to save for half. Alright, they save as fighters of the same thingy, so let me go over to my DM screen. Okay, saving throw table. Fighters, they are that hit dice, plus that becomes that. So this is spell. To save versus spell, they need a that. They both save for 11 damage total each, and that gets their attention. Wham! Light up the sky! And obviously there's nothing to bounce against to get him again. As the sky is in fact hollow, and the world is round. Okay! So, Akromid, you cast and zap them, and they look up, and they have eyes on you at this point. And they're taken off again in the air their giant bat wings, and Scorpius Umbra, they're flying right over you to go to Koromid. We'll turn around and wait for them to land, and then go for the back step. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. I will start casting. Oh shit, they're coming closer. Yeah, no, so at this point, party new. Does my spell? Magic <laughs> missile on the left one. Umbra, are you canceling your spell, or still attempting to hold them as they fly over? I was going to say, I'm going to start casting it. Okay, you were moving up to be in range, and they kind of passed over you. Like, as soon as they get in range, are you going to start casting? Uh, how much distance between me and Agoromid? Not 60 yards, less. I'll start you casting. Need... You'll start casting. Okay. Yep. Poopy. That's the wrong thing. I can, tell, I can obviously tell they're going for Agoromid. <laughs> yeah, they're beelining. <laughs> Huh, yeah, that's weird. So. I don't see anything about enchantment charm here. I guess that does work. Give me a second. <sighs> I was that's, I was worried about that. I didn't know if it would or wouldn't. So I was trying it anyways. <laughs> trying to circle them as they approach. Okay, demonic amulet. That doesn't help me here. Uh, 
Okay. I don't see anything relating to immunity to enchantment charm, so good luck, Umbra. Unless, Skrills, am I missing something? I don't think so. No. Lightning definitely half. There's a whole table about what does and doesn't work on them and how well it does and doesn't work. Okay. So I know what these things are doing. I believe I know what everyone is doing at this point. Scorpius, Umbra, you're casting. Okay. Guardsmen are firing their bows and the arrows are just bouncing off these guys. And there's Pandemonium. So you're casting Magic Missile. That takes a singular segment. Waiting for the spell, but you have to wait for them to land. Thinking, oh shit, maintaining thingy. Umbra, casting time on hold person. Five seconds. Work up just okay. had another oh shit moment. Okay. Uh, Ikrora what if these Mead. guys require enchanted stuff to hit? Ikrora Mead, you may dice your magic missile. On the left one. Six, nine, ten, eleven, plus five. Sixteen hit points. Sixteen points of damage, and I don't believe they get an immunity to that. <laughs> Right, you hurt that guy pretty bad, and he snarls at you and goes for the whip. <laughs> Grills, I assume you know what these things are. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now attacking at that level with that result, I think that's actually a hit. Your armor class is that, and they attack at Displaced. Point. You are displaced, that is correct. <laughs> Already making point of that. Negative two. <laughs> uh -huh. Well, funny enough, that would have hit negative two, but he is displaced. The next one goes, and he does miss his whip. Guys! These things have conjured up fire in circles around them as they start to land. They were doing the whip while they were still in the air. Okay, Umbra, at this point, they get their saving throws as you get your thing going. Mm -hmm. They have okay. a minus one. They have minus one, so that makes that that and that. The second one 100% saves. The other one I need to check. They save as fighters of the same level. Fighter at that level versus spell needs of that. I already looked this up because, yeah. Yeah, they both save. You felt the magic hit them, and it just they shrug it off. But that does alert them to your presence. Okay, now these guys have their flame thing, but they're far enough away from your Chromate you won't get caught up in it immediately. Uh, you've done your magic missile. Scorpius, these things surrounded by flame, are you approaching through this flame to stab at them? Likewise, Borgov, are you attacking? I'm sorry, there's a ring of flame around them. <clears throat> They've conjured flames around themselves, yes. <clears throat> Yeah, Borgov is how, not flame-proof. How high is the flames? Uh, let me check. <laughs> I'm looking. It doesn't say. I'm going to give it a value of maybe four feet taller, so these are powerful demons. Then he will wait until they step out of it, or the wing is extinguished. Okay. So, Scorpius, unless you're planning to throw a weapon, you're not going to be able to do anything for them this round. Uh, Borgov, you're maintaining, so I believe we're up to new, and at this point we actually need to start doing initiative rolls party. I should have remembered that. So, actions and initiative. Casting again, okay. Okay, somebody who's having better luck than me with initiative tonight, roll. How about I try this time? Yeah, go ahead, Vader. Attack, attack, the one hey, on the left. That's decent. Got four. Now, I have a funny question. Hmm. Uh, pirate telekinesis. If I try and telekinesis a person, does that function? Assuming they, they get resist, a saving throw. they get a saving throw. Okay. Well, hello, little spider. I see you came back. Are you claiming my post-it notes? <laughs> he likes he's, you. He's only a quarter of an inch long, and he's on this post-it note. Walk Scorpius, around. what are you doing? Waiting until I have a time to attack when they're not in the flame. Borgov, what are you doing? Going with their king, waiting for the fire or, or thing to disappear before he bothers. Okay. Scorpio, uh, Umbra, your thing has that much time. Five seconds. Hmm. Okay. 
Well, the one on the uh, left is going for a telekinesis attempt to drag you forward at Kroromid. So let's see. They can function as telekinesis there. So let's see. Telekinesis. They're casting time that many segments. You're approaching to attack, though, which is going to interrupt them. So, Akromid, you're going through the flame because you have that ring of flame, blah, blah, blah. Fire resistance, yeah. Yes, ring <laughs> of fire resistance. Look at me, guys. I'm running very complicated combat, and it's late. And I kind of regret this, to be honest. I should have just made it go morning. <laughs> nah, fuck that. Mm -hmm. I rolled up a demon. I'm giving you a demon. Effects of normal fires. Very large and hot fires. Molten fires. Demon immolation. Okay. Is this magical fire? If the wearer isn't direct within such conflict, I suppose. Saved against at plus four, all damage die. I can't play at two per die. Never less than one. As will thumb concern, very hot fires. Those are the maximum initial slows up to 20. Okay, so I'm reading this right at page 130 DMG. Okay. Demon immolation should qualify for what these guys do, right? Ooh, I guess so. So that would be 10 hit points, versus they do more. So you're actually getting a bonus here. So you will approach, and you will take 3 points of damage from the fire. Okay. But, well, no, that's magical, or... I mean, it's fire. I don't think that's stone skin worthy. No, it wouldn't set off stone skin. Okay. Okay, roll your first to hit. 16 before bonuses. Uh, 16 at that level before... Yeah, dice your damage. Who the fuck am I kidding? They are large. They are large. Uh, 15 hit points of damage. 15 hit points of damage on Lefty over there. Okay, that puts him at there. Well, you interrupt his attempted spell to bring you forward. The other demon is concentrating. And here's where it gets iffy. Umbra has five segments on that. What was the party's initiative again? Four, and the demon's Four. got a five. Five segments is already halfway through the thing. How long does a gate take? Well, if you want to treat it like the spell... Uh, let's is it check like a round? Or a few yes. rounds? As I know clerics have that. But if it's more than one round for casting time, then I'd make it their action for the round, because, you know. Hmm. Alright, so magic user version is nine segments. Let me check clerical version. Clerical is, I think, a round or two rounds. Probably. But which version would a demon use? Probably Demonic. the clerical. Probably. Yeah, I was thinking, I would say Five cleric. segments. It's... Five segments really? on Really? I thought it was longer. And they did win initiative. <laughs> Oof. Alright, so that is a successful gate. Oh no. No, no, this is spiraling out of control. Why did I do this? Okay, what type of percent do we have here? Type 3 or type 4? Let's get those numbers. Aren't both spells 5 segments? Yes, but they won initiative by 1. I, I, that was just more or less me confirming that they're both the same so that's a Type 3. I have a 1e. Give me a second, guys. I have really fucked the pooch here. I might actually level up tonight. You? I mean, I wanted to make it fun, and then I rolled up demons, and it's like, oh, this is going to be very fun. So these are devils. Where are demons? Because I got one, and I want to look at more options than just that guy. You are a minor demon, although I might summon you anyways. And I'm going to get a couple of drags while you figure it out. Mm -hmm. Woohoo! Well, it doesn't oh, tell they're me bringing what it back up? Hype it is. Gating. Okay, fuck it. Aiden! Roll me a detail. Actually, I should have made it Umbra for irony's sake. What do you mean, irony's sake? He. <laughs> Two. <laughs> Alright, let me roll this guy up. Should I max him out? Sure. Alright, I'm not hearing a no. Well, you're gonna, oh. <laughs> we're gonna end up destroying the entire town. Yeah. Well, if we kill the demons and there's nothing left standing, we can just loot. <laughs> yeah, we got a lot of looting to do. I mean, we'll have plenty of wagons to, to do it with. Not if all the wagons are destroyed. 
Wait, where is Drazil in all of this? Oh, he's away. He goes at night to do stuff. Yeah, but he's it he is before mm. morning. At dawn, usually. Sometimes a little bit after. He's not super punctual. Huh? Who's not super punctual? Jazeel. Jazeel. Oh. The boys are back in town. The boys are back in town. And this is what gets gated. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, oh, good news, Scorpius. You've got God. target. Oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, that guy right. finishes his thing, and they get to save now again, both of them. Two D20s. Oh, wow. I think they both failed. Good. <laughs> Fuck, I'm missing with that thing again. All right, I don't want that to... thing. Minus one to their saves. That guy fails, that one fails. Wow. Four and two. They, for they deserved it. They deserve it for something like that again. I don't want to see that again. Yeah, that thing appears and draws out a long sword and howls and Umbra, you could swear it's paying attention to you. Alright, Scorpius, right I assume you're moving to engage at this point, right? Akromid, you can take headshot. your second hit. Okay, I Scorpius can almost swear to my right leg. All three of my attacks are going to be headshots from that thing. You're not getting all three attacks, it's already halfway through the round. But your I haven't next even... thing will be uh, three attack, this will be two attack. Okay. Wait, so these demons failed the whole person? They failed the yes, whole person. Did. Wait, One of them succeeded it, their bait. Okay, right, Chromie. So, the two of them suddenly yep. stop moving. The fire is still there. What are you doing with your second attack? I will go for the instant kill on the one on the left that I've already hurt so much. Alright, you will kill it. Congrats. Okay. Orgoth will approach the other and see if there's a way to break through the fire without burning himself. Pretty hot you fire. A, Ring around you it. Have still a going. Pole arm. You have the reach. Can he stab through the fire? How long is that pole armor of yours? Actually, yeah, you know, you can stab through it. Roll the hits. I'm having you roll to okay. hit, even though it's not motionless, because you're trying to avoid the fires that are still going. <clears throat> yeah, Crow made the fires that were around your guy, they failed as this thing dies. Okay. That's funny. <laughs> Borgov, saving throw for your weapon as you stab it straight into the thing and it bonks off it. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Take your 50 XP. Oh, that's right, because it's not magical. Saving throw. Aww. Give me a d20. Roll oh, high. D20, I see. Watch him get a 1. 17, 11. Congratulations. You say your item saves. Is it good? It like vibrates in your hand with the force that you hit it with, and it's like. Bong. Uh huh. Wait. What? Bong. Sorry, guys. I'm not useful in this okay, fight. Okay, Scorpius. Apparently. You're up against this thing. It has a long sword. You have a long sword. Well, actually, what are you using? Both I'm daggers. Invisible. That's right. I'm invisible. Oh, that's a good point. So who is it targeting? Not you. Not you. Umbra! Oh, fuck off. <laughs> it's gonna go. Alright, Scorpius, this thing is charging for it to Umbra. I'm going to backstab it in the head. Okay. You're going to backstab it in the head. Yes. You're going for a sneak attack on the head. Okay, backstab. Uh, roll the hits. Me? Backstab. Is reduced by that, and your attack is plus four. Plus four. Oh, that's an eight. Yes. I like you. I see. I knew. Yeah. I knew that whole person would work eventually. Twenty six. Twenty six. I am fairly certain at ninth level at twenty six hits. Go ahead and give me a percentage roll. Oh, thank God. Fifteen. Fifteen. Okay. Where is Assassin's Table? Fifteen. And it's a twenty. Yeah, fifteen. And it's a twenty six. Oh. At sixth oh, level, and First I'm. First, we're determining using... if you instant killed it. So yes, you are a it's... six. I am using the plus two dagger with the five percent chance to assassinate. Scorpius, you stab it through the head, and it drops. Hey. Holy oh, fuck! Scorpius is doing it again tonight. <laughs> 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 All right, party dice initiative. As the last thing is struggling to move. Vader, that's that initiative. I think it's stuck for a turn. It ain't going nowhere. Okay. Okay. 
Oh, and then obviously put it in options. And I will say the command word to go back and Ah, you have a two. Necromede, you're approaching to kill the other one. You have yep. two. Huh. Alright. Hmm, gate takes five segments, and obviously it's trying that at this point, but five segments isn't as much I... time as it takes for you to go there and stab it in the head. Take three more <laughs> points of allowed? damage from the fire. Noted. And stab it in the head. Double M. Yeah. <clears throat> I might be wrong about this. Isn't it not allowed to do that? Uh, no. Is it allowed to gate? Because it's... What... Really? Yeah. Is yeah. it need to do... It's exercising a spell-like ability, not a spell. Uh... It doesn't have to make hand gestures or say words or anything. It wills it. Party. To occur. Hmm. The fight didn't take as long as I was expecting. But uh, <laughs> people That's are coming out of the various rubbles of some houses. And the... Uh, they are applauding you and cheering and... Oh my god, Party, you're the local heroes. I will pick up that longsword. Alright, you pick up the uh, thingy's longsword. I'm gonna go after, I'm gonna go talk to it for me. Hey, Boss, is this magic? <laughs> <laughs> my god. Get clear of fire, bind wounds. Akrora made the thing, the fire dissipated, obviously. Bind wounds get one hit point back. Okay. Uh, Scorpius, the handle is kind of covered in this red gunky thing from its hand, but well done, my man. <laughs> Anyway, Scorpius, uh, actually, hold up a second. Did you cancel your invi- Oh, yeah, you would've, and you didn't re-say it, so yeah, you're good. I, I was about I to did. have a- hmm? You never redid your invisibility? No, I, I did say that, but you didn't acknowledge it, so I'm just going with it. Well, it worked out this time. Okay, yeah, party, it- Well fucking done, that's two encounters I thought could be bullshit. Y'all just killed two Type 6 demons, and they're gated in Type 3 demon. Yeah, what the well, maybe fuck? you shouldn't have summoned that demon. <laughs> and a grandfather assassin! Well done, party. Yeah. Session over. Just hold on. We'll yeah, quickly well, maybe, get y'all back. Maybe to the they had well, summoned that. What kind that of blades demon? are those things using? Like, are those considered long swords or short swords? It's some fucked up thingy you've not really seen before if you look at the picture of it. Are you gonna try and take one? I would want one. So you're taking one? Yeah. Okay, you take one. And the town guard is both. taking both of them. Both. Okay. Town guard is showing up and they're they're right along with the applause. You got some magic users there applauding you as well. Well done. Boss, boss, does any of these smell like magic? Okay, so you are visible right now, correct? Yes. Okay. I'll give it a sniff. Nope. Nope. Uh -uh. Okay. Actually, hold on, wait, which of them? All three of them. Okay, so the thing that the Babu was holding, no. The other two, yes. Okay. <laughs> okay, yeah, these two are. Can I keep? Sure. <laughs> Yay! All right. Party, to make a longer story short, I assume you all will head back to the inn at this point after, you know, the town guard... Like ascertains you killed those things, they're dead, and you get like a huge congratulations from the people. And there's already clerics on the scene putting out some of the fires and so on and so forth. Okay, they've got clerics there. Mm -hmm. They'll ask uh, if any of you need healing. Yes. All right. Uh, one of them will come over and go for some heals. One. Do you need another? Yes. Demon fire hurts. Eight. Okay, I'm full up. Alright. So be... these two magic swords from these two demons, I don't know what they are. What kind of swords do they look like? Do they look like long swords? Do they look like short swords? Bastards? If you look at the picture and out of character chat, it kind of looks like a lightning bolt. Yes, I know it's a lightning bolt, but I need to know what classification it is. Well, assuming that's 12 feet tall from like bottom to top, that looks approximately the size I have for a long sword. But what if he said bastard sword? You know what? Fine. One of them's a bastard sword. <laughs> yes. You're going to have to I'm fight sorry. me for it. I will. Alrighty, enough of fighting. Yeah, I'll throw more I demons at you. Fuck it. I will summon Orcus, bitch. I don't know what that is, but I'm I'll, sorry. I'll, I'll, I'll <laughs> that didn't mean that. She recreates that invasion <laughs> oh, scene. No, it's okay. Well, party, congratulations. You fought off some even more powerful demons than last time. 
<laughs> well, uh, yeah. I love... Just, I, like, one whole person, and then I was like, I'll try it again. We'll see what happens. Assuming you all don't do anything special, I'll have you all head back to the inn, as light will start to shine upon Denalia, and Jazeel bips back in, and... Akronweed, he's giving you one of those looks, which is like, what the fuck did you do this time? <laughs> what did Why I is miss? the city half-destroyed? No, the city isn't half-destroyed, but there's a section of town that's kind of ruined. Demons, you know how it is. What, ta just what town guard blinks. bother you today? He just nods and blinks. He's used to it at this point. Well done, party. Boss. Well done. Are these things a common occurrence? Sometimes. You get used to it. They've been more common now that the blood moon happened. Yeah, fuck that night. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We had to be out there dealing with them. Yeah, Borgov, that something similar happened during the blood moon. The uh, guard was apparently aware ahead of time they had archers with magic bow uh, with magic bows and arrows landing the walls and even then some demons broke through and trashed some shit at one point it felt like that night again <sighs> so well done, uh, how am i going to help you people if i uh, can't hit those things hmm. don't worry you'll get there we'll find something for you go with the game plan go with the game plan live Hey, doing a good job so far. Okay, let me go copy these guys over. Amazingly, only two oh, real guy. encounters that were combat combat. Like, there was that one guy, but he was literally just trying to escape. <laughs> but man, is this going to be some fun XP for y'all. Oh, yeah. So, Q&A session as said? we do after session. What level demons were these? These were type 6 demons that gated in a type 3. Well, actually, so the bad boo isn't technically a type 3, it's only a minor? Actually, it might be type 4. Pat. That thing is a bastard. That's what that is. It doesn't say what type it is. It's the type that takes your leg. I think in Monster Manual 2, they moved away from type 1, type 2 to just common, uncommon, greater, minor, so on and so forth. So well, I think I'm bringing back to my level 1 anymore. Yeah, you're not going to be level 1. You're maybe, I'm going to say you're going to be like level 3 or 4, I want to say, maybe. We're about to find out. I'm about to crunch the numbers. Uh, feel free to ask questions. I cannot promise coherent answers, but I can try. So, two type six and a grandfather. Oh, yeah. So let's start That's with the 17 mercenaries. One of them was indeed a member of the town guard. Uh, were there any of them blood hunters, or were they just random mercenaries? That's somewhat out-of-world knowledge here. Uh, okay. But we'll just ask no one in this can. thing did, you know, in the name of Blood Hunter or anything like that. I mean, I, I already kind of did say out of character, and they're not this version's. This, they're not this universe's. <clears throat> name. No. So okay, now I've already said this much, and this shouldn't impact you all too much. Although I do love ratcheting up the fear with uncertainty, but in this case, I'll be blunt. These guys were just common mercenaries that are actually pretty common in Rinvera. You know, the place with a bunch of people that have a uh, fight to fight and nowhere to do it in. Mm. So this grandfather comes into town, does some scouting, and realizes he's up against an arch mage or some shit. He knows enough about magic, and he's smart enough to not just blow his shot the first second he finds him. So he watches for a bit, and he learns shit, and yeah, the rest is history. He had a rumor that y'all oh. had fought off a squad of blood hunters, so he thought to make that experiment on a small scale and see what happened, and then the opportune moment did arrived, and he took it. Did these drop their whip? They did. They had whips? They had I'm whips. I'm gonna go back and get them. Oh, I'll God. allow you to have grab them. Hey. More whips. Yeah, y'all are gonna get kinky with those whips. <laughs> no, Bullfrog doesn't like... Borgov doesn't like it like that. Bullfrog. <laughs> he's big he's crude Plus, man, and all these right. smell like magic I'll check them they do but not okay. Okay. is bullfrog going to be his nickname maybe Depends. Yes, it might stick oh man I still kind of wish y'all had fought in the marketplace where I had planned well not planned but I had done a lot of cogitating over how it was going to go and different factors so I'd be ready for when it happened in session like the said, cleric would have wiped the floor with them and cackled the whole time. 
Just saying, we did dig out a hole out of the room. You did. You totally did. Well done for that. Okay. A 10th level guy is worth 900 XP all on his own. Uh, Ikroami, that guy you fought, attacked at yep. 14th level. Nice. With stacked proficiencies in the longsword, mm. you immediately disar disarmed him of by him breaking it on your face. <laughs> uh, let's see. Wait, that leader was 14th level? He attacked at 14th. Oh, no, he attacked himself at 14th. Stacked at proficiencies. Yeah. So the, what was was the grandfather actually level fifteen? The grandfather is a fifteenth level assassin, as per the rank, with some really fucking good magic items to bear for it. Yeah, I I, I figure that high level people like that are obviously good magic Special items. Special ability, I don't think these guys get any because they're just mercenaries, albeit powerful ones. Okay, no way in hell you get to level fifteen with no magic items. Mm -hmm. Times two plus two times ten times ten times seventy. Oh my bad, I had them at sixty. Okay, fourth level guys. Oh, first time fighter. That was interesting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Four times ninety plus four times yeah. uh Vader. Hmm? Uh, as as for what you five. wanna do, like in those situations where you can't do anything, parry. Hey guys. Just stay back here. I know Lydia you're collecting demonic weapons and shit now, but you might want to hand over one of those lightning bolt looking swords to the dwarf that ain't got shit. <laughs> He's got a... What does he have? Nothing magic. I, can't, I, keep, I, wanna, I keep wanting to say halberd, but I know it's not a halberd. So That's halberd's the first thing I think of. Shit. When I think polearm, I think halberd, because it's the only thing I know. I will lend it to him until he can, if we can get something he's proficient with. But these are long swords. Well, one of them is a bastard one. sword now. Yeah... I get another oh, demon weapon. Let's go. Okay. 15th level guy is 2,400. Plus. I'm curious what these are. How weird is that going to be bringing into the cleric? I'm like, hey, yeah, so we have these. Yeah, I heard the rumors, guys. What the hell? 26. Plus, he so did have it, some well, good ability, I'd say. Is the whip magic? For those who don't know, this is what he's holding around. Ah, that thing. Okay. 1250 and 1600, I'm gonna say. The hammer spear spike. Hmm. Okay, that's the assassin. Not bad. Now for the demons. And this doesn't include the magic items, of course. That will be calculated. Level separately. six times. Also, there's strong. the crow's beak. Okay. Oh yeah, you, oh yeah. Scorpius gets all the uh, magical item at XP. Well, no, uh -huh. because if I get those who get have been all? distributed get it. So, for example, a crow mini gets XP for the cloak. Umbra, you get XP for the what you ever you got, so on and so forth. I got nothing. I gave you, you a, a plus dagger, two dagger. But you, you don't get XP for it because oh, Scorpius shit. already got that XP. No, wait, hold on, he didn't. No, I didn't because I didn't identify it. Oh, cool. I, I did you guys that. Okay, so hold on. This guy is a 8 uh, plus 8, eight, eight creature. So over to DMG. 8 plus 8, it's functionally there. That is 2 times 900 plus 14 times 72 times 2. And then they get their spell-like power bullshit many times over, really. They did use the gate, so we do get the XP for that. Right? Mm -hmm. So that works. And then the Babu Demon, who I've already calculated before, but I'm going to calc again just to be quick. He's a 7 plus 14 hit dead creature. Puts him at there for 600 plus maxed out Burst his hit points. Him. She swears that her right mm -hmm. leg, her leg starts to tingle. <laughs> oh, look, your man is doing work. Go ahead. It was my right leg, okay. Yeah, I hit it right. 
It should have been both I legs. Race that. I mean, really, it should have been your head. I was just being very nice. Yeah. And I'm grateful for that. Mm-hmm. Okay, finish getting the raw numbers much. together, and now to calc it all together, then divide it up. Valor. Yeah, no, I that's not the right number. Um, Does oh, the guys, core uh, know uh, what these things were? No. Okay. I'm almost entirely certain that I'm mispronouncing the umlaut. 375 times. Two what? It's two dots over the O. I was expecting that to be a hard fight, guys. What the hell? Oh, man. Man. I it got was lucky. It's going to be a hard fight. Well, I got, we both got lucky. 18 like, plus it, double. It would have been a hard fight, and it would have gotten. More of the place destroyed, except for the whole person actually went off on both of them. No, I think he was off. Oh, yeah, that that was pretty bam. That was awesome. First time I did it, I was like, I have another. I'm going to do it again. So happy you did that. I was I like, like, I'm like one. amazed at y'all managing to take these higher level threats and win. And it's like, hot damn, at this point, the party exceeds the whole party in deadliness, I think. Okay, now hold on. The thing about that was, that was, that was luck. Yeah, no, I think I'm gonna have party? to throw super like, demons at you at this point. Uh, well, like, a Cormie oh, could have taken them, probably. Guy. Right? A Cormie car probably could have taken them. The only reason why it was so fast, because Umber got lucky there, and she was like, fuck you. Oh, wait, are you guys planning on having a session, Stop. another session soon? Thursday. Oh. You don't think you'll be able we to normally do a, We normally do them on Thursdays. Uh -huh. It's just that everyone thought today that no. there was going to be a thing and there wasn't. I was like, hey, who wants to do a session? Boy, that was a fun decision. <laughs> yeah. I wonder, could I have taken those things Two by myself? Six. Go ahead and look them up. I know you want to. I'm going to. So, I have a question about the, the fire, actually. I was I really want to know. Is that fire not considered magical fire? Or is it a different type? Yeah, It's, it's a demonic self-immolation which is different than normal fires in that a ring of fire resistance reduces it, but, but completely eliminates it. There are certain spells I have, right? Is it Does it get classified as magical fire? Or is it a weird... I believe it's magical. Yeah. Okay, so if, it, if there was... Is the weapon okay? Okay. I, I have... There are spells, there are cleric spells that counter magic fire. I was wondering how that worked. Plus if it was, if the demon fire was weird and countered the countered the magic fire, I don't know. It was beyond magic fire. Oh man, know. we're into the five digits for XP today, guys. Nice. Damn. Now, granted, that does get split up between y'all. Yeah. But there are four people. Mm-hmm. A flame walk. Maybe that would actually do it. I'm pretty sure. Fl yeah, no. Well, hold up. Oh yeah, flame wood would. F wait, do you get do you get saving throws against magic fire? A double M. Yeah. So you get ma you get saving throws to magic fire. You get saving throws to magic fire. Maybe. Hmm. In this in this spell, it says you get a bonus. You get a plus two to saving throws against magic fires, unless that's. Girls, like should a Chromie have gotten a saving throw for magic fire? I mean, oh. it's no point at this thing, but. Uh... <laughs> I mean, you know, I'm just I'm just curious because it yeah, sounds good because of my scarab. Oh, that's right. You didn't remind me. It just me says on here that you get it. bonuses to to magic fire, and I'm guessing that's maybe if it's cast like on you or you getting shot with fire. But maybe if it's walking through it. Let me see. Let me see. Bring the fire resistance. Doesn't the cloak of displacement also give you pluses to your two. senses? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, it does. Huh. Well, then. 
So we just made an unkillable man just a little bit more unkillable. Basically, yeah. Basically. Harder to kill. I'm yes. just going to have to drop I a am. pyramid on him, I think. That's the way to do it. <laughs> just just drop a hole. Well, what did, what did they do? The, uh... Well, no, if you drop a pyramid on him, he'll continue to regenerate. Maybe what was that thing Drake that might be destroyed what was that by thing it. they did? Uh, what was it? Grills. What was that thing they did to that one person? They dropped a whole like city on them, or a whole mountain. The emperor dropped his citadel on him. Yeah, just do that. I mean, I could, but nah. But I ain't by going the time the, the thing shots. falls, he could teleport away. Now tell me, adventurers. Other than us forgetting about the uh, Scarab of Protection, yeah, I think you handled that fine mm -hmm. with the, the demon immolation. Especially keeping up with the fact that I had to run... Oh, great, they're summoning in another demon. Great. Fuck. But hey, I ran it. it w I don't think a better DM could have run it. No. I don't think another DM could have run that much better. Especially with an unexpected outage as I was rolling the shits up. That was great. I love that. Both I thought both my both of them got hell personed. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, let me start calcing that uh, magic item XP. So Krogan, you got the cloak of displacement, Scorpius, so. yep. you got the leather armor and the plus three dagger. Umbra, you got a plus I two got dagger. A plus... Oh, yeah. Who one has one. the arrow of slaying? That would be me. You. Are you okay. claiming that I item only to use up it? Once. Yes. Okay. Twice. That means you're not gifting it to anyone. Mm -mm. Okay. In that case, you get the XP for that as well. Actually, I got the ring, the dagger, and the armor. You do? Mm -hmm. And the arrow. I got four <clears throat> magic items. For XP to get from. <clears throat> That's because we identified two daggers. They're plus two that I bought and the plus three I got from the assassin. I gave you the plus two. I'm done arguing with Doras to let his character get XP. <laughs> Was he against it? Yeah, he says, oh, these guys should get it. And I'm like, no, no, that's actually not from the calc. It's entirely separate. Because the fact is, Doras had to listen to the short, uh, what's his guy, cursing in basically every tongue that he knew as he spent longer and longer in the fucking city waiting for you guys to show back up until he finally gave up. So that that's worth some experience right there. He knows all the curse words in demonic now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. It's let's gonna go be like look that. At the unearthed oh, arcana, God, starting with giving. that lovely dagger plus three. That's an equal sign. So there's no is, dagger. He's equal third sign. level now. Oh, isn't it? Nice. Congrats. Yeah, I guessed right. Third level. Okay, you also had leather armor plus three, correct? Yes. Mm-hmm. An arrow of flame plus three, and a ring of invisibility. God, the name's escaping me now. And inaudibility. Yep. Yeah, that ring, don't worry. I remember that ring. Now I'm looking for that armor, and it's killing me. Elfin oh, chain. <clears throat> there it is, yeah. Now I've got it. Oh, hello. Uh, Grills, what was the the uh, Titan Veiled? He has a nightmare. He Oakley. That oh, is uh, Oakley. That's what it was. Yeah. There okay. we go. Sorry. One that can swear and do magic damage, do death magic to you. Uh, not death magic, but uh, yeah, painful shit. Reminds me that. I 
should edit that. Hey, well, uh, John, there was an insult and, uh, what was it? Okay. Okay. Troll. Yeah, that's something, isn't it? What? Oh, wait, Aiden, undo that. Undo. Land but, but, value. But, no, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. That was the wrong column. What about the troll? Oh, plant thanks eater. To Lars, John. Thanks to, to Lars, John knows how to call a, a troll and a vegetarian. Oh yes. yes. Ooh, such <laughs> I love that. Thing. That's the big insult for them. Damn, that leather armor plus three is stacked, though. You're nothing more than a plant eater. <laughs> a malnourished plant grubbing. Okay, and then the arrow of slaying. <laughs> oh, guys, I thought I leveled up. Yeah, no, you did not get 200,000 XP from magic well, items. That was the GP 20, sale value. Oh, my bad, 20,000. That's the GP sale value. <laughs> Are you selling them for gold pieces? No, not bad. <laughs> no. Although you couldn't then get the XP that way. <laughs> My god, no. Okay. Is that how you do it now? You take the XP for magic and then you sell it and then you get more gold and then you no, get more XP. You don't, the you don't get the XP unless you intend to use it. Scorpius, you intend to use all four of these items, I assume. Mm -hmm. use, it like, use it for like a day. It counts, right? Yeah, if you try sidelining the DM that way, then you'll get the XP for having used the item for a day, and you'll get the money, but you won't get the XP for the money. Cloak of Displacement. Huh. Oh, yeah, I'm not low enough. God, it is such a steep climb to level 6. Is that including the XP from, from the six ring? To seven. That is including the XP from the ring. Actually, hold on. Let me double check that. It is such a steep climb from like six to seven. It oh, is. I know. Okay. With magic users, it's only twenty thousand to forty thousand. Well, are you a magic user? Where the fuck is this? He was here a minute ago. Thirty-five. That's forty. One. Two hundred. Here, fuck it. It's in the DMG. Eight. The hell is it? Uh, I have to scroll through it manually. I'm sad. Huh. So how in over his head is Borgoff? Pretty. Very. You'll get up to us eventually. Ring of that. No, he might get up to uh, maybe Umber and Scorpius, but. Yeah, Aiden, that yeah. number is correct. Okay. Dagger. <laughs> okay, Umbra, you got a plus two dagger. I did. Oh, I've still got a. Raider, you should only be like level two. I looked up Fighter. From 1 to 2, it's it 2,000. Does... From 2 to 3, it's 4,000. At least, it's in this total. Items and XP, yes. I am a genius. Oh, wait, no. no not... All right, Dora's didn't get anything. Vader yeah, you're didn't right. get no, anything. Mind. Wait a second, wait a second, what the fuck is this? At least he has his dignity. Hey, yeah. <sighs> well, I don't know when I did it, but I broke assassin. Nice! I should be an 8th level assassin now. I'm 59,000 over. Huh. Huh. Yeah. 
Ooh. Well, if it's of any consolation, you still would have been insta killed as that fifteenth level assassin yeah. killed uh, even Steve. Yeah. Uh, let me update. Nice. Most of what I did were all assassinations, pretty much. <clears throat> Uh, not that it matters. Because it's never going to catch up with fighter. Now, breaking ninth is going to be the fun one because that's when I get the uh, quadruple damage. But that means I got 30 points. Dungeon Master, you got any beef with me assigning those? Uh, where, do you, where do you plan to assign them? Uh, either locks, traps... Pass without trace, tracking, hear noise, or climb walls. Uh, tracking and climb walls. Oh, my bad. Pass without trace and climb walls. I don't think you've really done enough of, unless you think otherwise. Eh, okay. Otherwise, yeah, most of those skills seem good. Well, I still got thirty-five points I've yet to use. Well, do you want to okay. spend them somewhere? <clears throat> Earning character. Earning character, I guess. Probably next session. I'm, I'm too tired to open that back up. Alright. Well, hey, open it up later and uh, let me know what you'd like and I'll tell you if it's possible. GG uh, party. Well done this session. Real special props to you. I actually killed a Crowermead and you rolled with oh. it pretty well. Thank you. It's a hard and thing I to do. Been... But when you're a 15th level assassin who has the time and determination, it's possible. And look what that got him. And a ring of invulnerability. Inv invulnerability, yeah, no. Invisibility and audibility. And a plus three dagger. And a bunch of gold to spend on some goons to beat the party up so you could get through stone skin. <sighs> Feel free to let me know if you think any of that process was a little too iffy for your tastes. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, if you think he shouldn't have known about stone skin and blah blah blah, feel free. Uh, I'll accept criticisms here, party. I am not perfect. I think it's pretty. Co if you know a Cormor, you know stone skins. I'm sure by now. Well, it's not that common of a spell, but it doesn't have to be for the effects to have been seen. Yeah, maybe not the name, but they know of what it, what you are and what it does. You now, you bleed sometimes, but sometimes now, you don't. But when you start bleeding, your bandits survive. Oh yeah, several of them ran. Probably ditched the armor or got rounded up. You'll have to find out. <clears throat> yeah, it depends if you're spending some time in the city still or taking off at morning like you wanted to. I should point out you all are wide awake. Demon fights do that. Yeah. I mean, we still have to go to my temple. Hey, Mama. We might make it to your temple. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to ask. And that's when Scorpius, the town guard, actually tries to arrest you for killing a beggar. <laughs> I loved that so much. That was the perfect opening. Yeah, right. uh, and I'm willing to bet, Aiden, you actually thought I was going to do that. Yeah. Yeah. It was perfect. Oh, Double I've... M. I'll be asking about golems and stuff. So You'll be asking about golems. Ooh. I'm okay, sure you'll I have to ask Grills for a quick lesson on golems. That's why I was well, like, I should probably tell him wait, now. Because I'm still waiting for oh, a few yeah. of my own lessons to get through. Mm -hmm. I'll throw it in the to-do list. Do you want me to throw anything in to-do list for you, Aiden? No, he already knows which lessons. They're in it's in the... Okay. Arts, I, don't know. I just I figured I'd tell you just so that you're appreciate ready the heads to tell up. me whatever. 
I'm it's sure you'll either looking just it up like, in session. I'm sure you'll end up just being like, I, I was imagining you were going to be like, yeah, uh, I'll message you later about that. Or you were going to be like, yeah, well, this 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 priest you're talking to seems to not know much about it. Come back later. Well, no, you've given me a heads up, so yeah, basically you spared yourself that. I'm going to go mute I mean, and deaf for a second, BRB. That's fine. So, uh, how did you like me playing a new character? Yeah, uh, uh, I think it was good for you. And I think you did good doing it. Hey, I'm back. Welcome back. Okay. By the way, Aiden, don't let this lovely session overshadow something very important. <clears throat> we figured out a way to game disruptions by having your character swallow the uh, destroyer for two minutes. What? Remember Warframe Disruption? That mission we ran oh. before we did this? You can just swallow the destroyer guy, and then we don't have to bother fighting him. Not gonna lie, you said that, and I thought you were talking about something in, in Talon Cross, and I was like, what? I was, I was confused. I was like, Scorpy for swallowing what and who? What? <laughs> yeah, I yes. was just like, huh? Some people what have a one-track mind. I have a mind that switches tracks like a fucking railgun.